The new set for Legendary was announced, Civil War, coming out in June, right after the release of the Civil War movie. Right. Go figure. Uh, we don't. We know very little about it. Really, what we know is the box art. Right. So all we can really speculate is what we've seen in the box. Now, what's interesting is, I mean, we see a lot of characters there that we we've already had in the game, like Iron Man, Captain America. But uh, I think some of the more interesting ones are, for example, we have we can see Iron Spider there, which would be another interesting addition. Mm -hmm. uh, but what's also interesting is if you look on uh, the far right, uh, it looks like Maria Hill. I mean, I don't know my shield agents that well. Well, I've, uh, it definitely looks like a shield agent. Mm -hmm. I, I don't think we know who it is, but I've heard some other uh, speculation that it might be uh, Daisy Johnson, a.k.a. A Quake, Quake, a.k.a. A shield yeah. character. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, one of the, that, either of those would be good. I think Maria Hill deserves a chance to be a character after being a, a useless card for so long in that game. Well, what I want, I want to... Um and again, I, I, never mind, because I can't forget his name. I feel bad. <laughs> From the show? Yeah. Coulson? Yes, thank yeah. you. <laughs> Coulson, Coulson. I love yeah. Coulson. Yeah, no, yeah. He would definitely also, because I, lo I love the way the, um, like, I know one of the reasons I like, I just wish there were more things, like Nick Fury, things that acted with shield cards. Like, I mean, mm. I think that's really interesting. And I think, and I'm actually disappointed, there aren't ones for Hydra, really. Mm. Yeah, that's true. Things that make more use of the cards that already exist there. And then what could be mu even more interesting is then you can make cards like if you don't know the last one came with a set and so someone can play the supervillain. What if you made cards then so like everyone the good guys use shield agents that person uses Hydra guys, and then in the hero deck there are some that use so like he'd want to buy the cards that work for Hydra symbols but you mm. want to buy the cards that work for shield symbols. That'd be interesting, and well it, you could definitely make something like that work also with the Civil War theme. Yeah. <laughs> So they did have a Civil War scheme, right? Didn't they? They did, the older in one? the original one. So I wonder yeah. if they'll redo that or not. Well, my guess is uh, one of the characters, obviously. I mean, But I think there's going to be, like, uh, just like the Super Bowl, an overarching like, team battle style. Mm -hmm. Like maybe you each have a super... I'm thinking sort of like the DC deck building game, how you'd each have your own mastermind to fight against. Huh. Some people have also been speculating that maybe we'll see new mastermind versions of Captain America and Iron Man. No, that's what I was like, thinking. Yeah. That you would actually, that, like each one would have to fight the other one. Right. That, yeah, that's, that sounds kind of cool. I like that. I, I think that would be a really interesting, even if you didn't use those two, like just other two, like, especially with the yeah. villain set. Yeah. So you could use like, uh, one side has to beat Xavier S, the other side has to beat Magneto or something that and would have some fun. Also give a lot more life to those masterminds because yeah. you have a whole new way to use them. Well, and then throwing the one, all the cards from the last set that made it so new masterminds popped up. Right. <laughs> I'm the spider queen. I have or, no, remember the other guy? He becomes the king oh, of the cosmos yeah, yeah, and yeah. kills all the masterminds. The, I don't know what everybody was called, but yeah, he just kills everyone else. <laughs> that, was a good, that was a good set. Uh, no, the Secret Wars was amazing. So this has high standards for me to live up to. I think main, one reason I'm really excited for it is because I'm ready to see more familiar characters and less crazy outside the box. Uh, like you know, like I love the I love they put they put the you know the dinosaur in there and all that stuff. Right, but you're where's Ant Man? Right, which I, and I think we'll probably see a lot of those like Avengers and stuff in this box, which I think will be. Cool. Well, I'm I'm assuming we're gonna see uh, Falcon because he's literally on there. Falcon is it would be although they did put Howard the Duck and that's true that was, <laughs> on wow. the other cover and he well, wasn't playable. Well, the only reason that is annoying is because we know that there's the playable. <laughs> right. So so it felt like a slap in the face yeah. a little bit. I also see is that that is Thor, right? Or is that like a different Thor? Uh, some I don't other know Norse the guy? Yeah, I don't know. But anyway, Civil War, and we're super excited to see that movie, which will also be better than <laughs> than Batman v Superman. Spoilers: <laughs> We didn't like it. Save your money, folks. Instead, buy the Batman game and the Superman game and just mash them together. <laughs> or buy DC deck building. <laughs> I don't know. I guess that would be simpler. Well, or the Batman vs. Superman DC deck building. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Is there a Batman vs. Superman Dice Masters? Isn't there some <coughs> World's Finest or something? Yeah, there's World's Finest. Anyway. Pretty much, there's a many other choices you <laughs> yeah. can choose. Not the movie. So many. For more suggestions, uh, please send us an email.